Hey guys, so today I'm here with a video giving you a full hands-on of App Inventor for Android. So this is a really, really cool tool that allows you to create your own Android applications from inside your browser. And you don't even need to know code. Uh, so let me just go ahead and just jump right in. So I'm going to go ahead and create a new one and just create a project name. Let's say this will be a uh, uh, project. Really, I know, a great name. But So we go ahead and start it up. And as you guys can see, it's really, really pretty interesting, as it's not all that difficult to understand. Um, so the main thing is just to go ahead and create it. So as you can see here, you have all kinds of different things. So for example, we can go ahead and grab a button, drag it over here, and now we have a button. Um, you can do a lot of different things, such as an image, um, a text box. We're just gonna, I'm just going to drag a couple things in here just to kind of give you guys a, a sense for how it works. Uh, you can go down here and go media, so you can actually go ahead and add like sound or video player. Um, you can go ahead and add animations. You can actually even add this, drop it in here, and actually make a phone call. So you can actually just hit a button from inside your app and make a phone call on your Android phone. It's really cool. Um, let's go ahead and just clear out some of this stuff here. Hang on a second. and actually show you guys how it works. Um, so actually, let's go ahead and just select this button. So let's say we want to customize the button. Well, over here on the right side, we'll see properties, and there are actually quite a few things. We can go ahead and do the alignment, actually make a custom image, background color. There are a lot of different things. Do the font. Um, we can go ahead and pick the width. I mean, yeah, the width and everything. So let's go ahead and just let's just do something random. Let's do 130. Let's make a giant button. So let's do 130 by 130. Let's scroll down just a little bit. Uh, so. There we go. Now we have a giant button. Um, now we can go ahead and do all kinds of stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, do a phone call. So let's drag that in here. And let's just call a number, say, 1555555555555. Hopefully nobody has that number. Um, so we can go ahead and just do that. And there we go. So if you click that button right now, it will go ahead and give a, call that number. And you can do a lot of other things. You can actually go ahead. Um, so let's go ahead and come back over here to the button. And we can actually go ahead and do an image. So let's say, um, let's say this was you wanted to create your own custom app just to go ahead and uh, uh, call your best friend. Or, okay, so you can go ahead and take this image and you can go ahead and add an image of your best friend. Click the button and it will just uh, call him using your phone. I know it's 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 really it's not it's not all that useful. It's kind of it's kind of a little stupid, but I mean it just kind of goes to show you that there are a lot of different things. Um, so let me just go ahead and go through a couple others. You can go ahead and actually activate the accelerometer, the location, even the orient orientation. So there's a lot of things that you can actually go ahead. It's not just like, you know, it's a little bit of text, this and that. So let me just go ahead and just do one thing in here. Let's go ahead and delete all this stuff right here. And let's just do one thing. So let's go ahead and uh, jump over here and let's grab a video player. So let's drop it in here. And then let's go ahead and just choose a file so I already have one of my videos so let's go ahead and just drag and drop that in there and we'll give it just a second so we're going to create a little bit of an app that will actually go ahead and play a video so we're going to go ahead and play a video and while that's uploading let's come over here and uh, let's add a text box so we're going to go ahead and have a text box down here let's leave pretty much everything alone except it's going to say uh, type here Okay, so really simple. So I'll go ahead and do that, and there we go. So this is our app. This is going to be a video player and a little text box. So once we're ready, we can go and come up here and hit package phone, and go ahead and go ahead and download actually to your connected Android phone, or you can go ahead and download it to the computer. So I'm going to go ahead and do this, and I'll be right back. Okay, so let's just go ahead and show you guys my app. So we'll go ahead and just open it up here. And there it is. <laughs> so it's nothing all that exciting. Um, if you want to just quickly, I can show you um, the type here. So we can say hello in this box. And up here, if we want to click on it, we actually go ahead and watch the video. So nothing all that exciting, like I said. But there is a lot more you can do with this. Especially, there's I didn't even show you the block editor, which is pretty in-depth, where you can actually go a lot farther than you know just dragging and dropping a few UI elements. So it's really cool. So guys, I definitely recommend go ahead and check it out um, if you're interested making Android apps it's not all that difficult um, and it, it's a really really cool deal anyway guys thanks for watching